as we gather here in our national parliament today, we have war in Europe, resulting in the largest forced displacement of people since World War II. Levels of inflation not seen in four decades and concerns that Europe could be facing an energy crisis. The outlook for the global economy is being downgraded. We have no government in Northern Ireland and we, we've witnessed political turmoil in London. The full impact of Brexit on our island remains unresolved and COVID-19 is on the rise again. Sinn Féin's answer is to call for a general election. Sinn Féin's approach to opposition is very simple. Promise everything to everyone, say whatever you have to say to get into government and worry about the consequences afterwards. The promises being made by Sinn Féin amount to billions and billions of euro. Sinn Féin are building a level of expectation of what they can deliver in government that is utterly unrealistic and unrealisable. In their heart of hearts they must know this and it is a deeply cynical approach to politics. Some of those who will support Sinn Féin today have had not one but two opportunities to enter government in recent years but chose the safe and comfortable benches of opposition where it is easy to have all the answers and none of the responsibility. No one on this side of the House is denying that our country faces many challenges, not least the imperative to build more homes quickly, to reform our health service and to address the cost of living pressures that many are facing. This government has managed our economy and our public finances well. Our economy is now close to full employment. At times this House and certainly this opposition seem to take those fundamental achievements for granted. But it is a successful economy and well-managed public finances that give us the resources to intervene and support people who are genuinely under pressure from the rising cost of living. Our focus now is on the budget. It will be a cost of living budget, 6.7 billion euro, and a separate package of one-off measures to help people who face real challenges. That's Ciarán Corla, we have a strong and a stable government. This government does not claim to get everything right, but it is a government of three parties who accepted the responsibility of office, who are working well together, and with the support of this House, which I hope is affirmed today, the government will continue to be honest and to do our best for the people of this country. Thank you. Thank you.